What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Today we're taking a look at Ethereum and its recent price action, and make sure to watch the video till the end for a price prediction for the short and the long term as well. First things first, please smash the like, subscribe and hit the bell icon. YouTube is not pushing crypto content out currently and our subscribers aren't getting notifications, so make sure to join our free Telegram to stay up to date with all of our videos as they are posted. Links in the description. It really helps if you hit the like. We're posting four videos per day, so come back every day for daily updates and analysis. And make sure to comment down below for your chance to win a hardware wallet in our new monthly giveaway. We'd also like to thank you all so, so much for your support. We've just hit 10k subscribers, so make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, we've had many reports that our subscribers aren't seeing our content, and this is most likely because you haven't hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon with all notifications turned on. Give it a tap now, turn on all notifications, and you'll most likely see most of our videos being posted. Also, if you want to support the channel, make sure to tap that like, it really, really helps us out. We're posting four videos per day, so make sure to check back every single day for daily updates. So we're just taking a look at Ethereum here, and I mean, things are going exceptionally well, aren't they? You can see quite clearly, still heading in our massive uptrend that we have been talking about, you know, at basically ad nauseum for the past uh, six or so months. You can see quite clearly on our chart here that, you know, things are going very well, moving up within this very, very nice channel here. Obviously, everyone was saying it was the end of the world when we had this big bearish period recently. Obviously, as everyone knows, big crash in May. The market was trading downwards and to the side ever since then, but obviously recently showing a, showing a lot of signs of life and we are absolutely exploding out of the gates, aren't we? With this big reversal that we are seeing in the market, obviously a lot of bullish divergences on a lot of uh, cryptos, especially Bitcoin. You can obviously see there's a big bullish divergence here with our histogram, which is essentially just the momentum of the market. You can see big crash here. We came down again and formed this nice bet, a bullish divergence here. And they actually continued to go and go and go until eventually we reached the point where the big reversal was about to happen. And as you can see, this all coincided nicely with, you know, breaking out of resistance here, flipping it into support, coming back down, double bottom back test the previous level that we did hit at around $1,700. And you can see since then, we have essentially just been doing, you know, this perfect W-shaped recovery. We obviously thought we would be hitting some resistance here at the top of the channel that we were in, but it does look as though we are actually showing a lot of bullish momentum in the market for Ethereum, aren't we? Because you can see we've actually broken all the way up to around $3,200 here and actually come down and perfectly back tested around that $2,900 level, currently trading at around $3,100. So you can see, you know, things are going very, very well for Ethereum right now, aren't they? We're currently, you know, jamming, you could say, in and around this 127 level. On our Fibonacci extension, you can see we've just dragged this from the, the top of the previous bull market to the bottom of uh, this bear market right here, and you can see some of our extensions we're looking for. And we're currently, you know, bouncing in and around this 127 level here basically trying to figure out what to do next because we have had a very, very big move to the upside with no real pullbacks. So we would anticipate potentially a pullback quite soon. That would probably come back to around this $2,700 level because there's no way that we can continue price action like this forever. This is obviously not sustainable. Just like when we were back here and we were, we were looking at this price action, we were saying this is not sustainable price action for Ethereum and sooner or later we are going to see a correction. And we saw, you know, a pretty terrible one because we didn't back test any key levels of support and we basically just, you know, we absolutely collapsed all the way back through all this big pump that we did here, didn't we? And we're doing a similar thing now, so just be aware. Look how similar this looks to this. And basically just, you know, be aware that we could be looking at a quite a significant pullback quite soon before, you know, potentially continuation. Because you could say, arguably, we've come down. We've had a high. We've obviously had our lower low. Lower high, lower low. And then we've come up. We've made, you know, another lower high, but, you know, we've actually made a higher low here. And then now we're making our higher high, but we do need to see our higher low starting to do something like this before we do see that trend reversal out of this bottom that we're forming. Because you can see we're forming this bottoming pattern here quite clearly, but we do see, need to see, you know, a full reversal of the trend before we do see uh, start to see some some good stuff for Ethereum. But, you know, things are looking very nice, aren't they? On the weekly time frame here, pretty obvious that we're doing very, very well indeed. We've obviously reclaimed our 20 moving average on the weekly very strongly, looking for absolute continuation in my opinion here. Things looking really, really good, aren't they? You can see quite clearly things going very well. Definitely that 10, 15, 20k Ethereum in the next year or so looking more and more likely. Only, I mean, 10k in itself is only around a three and a bit X from here, which seems very, very reasonable in our opinion as a good price target. 
and that would obviously be our 161 extension here. Obviously, we think 50, what is this, 54K is a bit of a stretch for the 227, but we do think that 15 or 20K probably quite possible and realistic if we're looking at, you know, the bull run potentially ending in December, January time. We're looking at around, you know, mid-January for 15K, you know, late, uh, mid-December for 15K and late January for 20K if we, you know, we're going to respect this channel that we have been, you know, respecting this whole time. You can see quite clearly we formed this channel coming upwards like this. And obviously it's pretty clear to us that, you know, Ethereum's on a journey right now, isn't it? And it's it's looking for that that last push and that blow off top before the end of the bull run. So we are, you know, we're feeling very confident about Ethereum. It's had a really, really nice pump recently. Obviously, we, ha we do need to be seeing a bit more of a pullback in our opinion, just to retest some levels again before the continuation to the upside. But things looking really, really good. Our short term price prediction would be just to be careful. And be aware of a potential pullback because we are getting, you know, this is a lot of days of just green candles. Obviously, there's been a few red candles, but for the most part, we've just been going straight up pretty much. So I do anticipate that we could potentially be seeing a pullback quite soon. But obviously, in the long term, as we always say, we do think things are going to do very, very well. And Ethereum, you know, it could keep pumping, but, you know, the more it pumps, the more chance of it having a, a decent pullback. Considering, you know, this is pretty much just straight up with not really much of a break, so... Just do be aware of that, but we do think, you know, 10K by the end of the bull run in the next six to eight months for Ethereum, very, very likely. 15 or 20K possible as well when you look at the charts. So that's our update today, guys. We'd like to thank everyone for watching. If you have any comments, questions or suggestions, please let us know down in the comments section below. Please make sure to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can keep up to date with all of our videos. Remember to comment down below and be subscribed to enter into our brand new monthly giveaway for a hardware wallet. If you'd like to support the channel more directly, please sign up to our Patreon via the link in the description below or sign up to YouTube membership by hitting the join button right next to the sub below this video where you can get access to our private Discord. We're offering coin calls, one-to-one -one access to us personally, insight into our personal portfolio, daily research of crypto assets with massive potential and access to our brand new 100x portfolio with so many benefits you might as well check it out below. Don't forget to get two free stocks with Weeble by signing up and then depositing $100 using our link in the description below. You can quite literally deposit the $100, get your two free stocks and then withdraw the money. So there's no reason not to do that and they could be valued all the way up to $1,600 each. But don't forget to actually deposit as well after signing up, otherwise you won't receive the second stock. Scammers get worse every day so make sure to protect yourself and your crypto online with pure VPN. Sign up below for some big discounts. You can get access to block content and protect yourself from phishing scams with super low monthly payments and high quality speeds. You can also sign up to our free telegram via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto. So go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are Crypto Maximalists.